Hi everyone, welcome to the weekly update with IT Pro Today. I'm your host, Nicole Henderson. I'm here every Friday talking about the week's top tech headlines and why they matter to IT pros like you. This week we've got acquisition news from F5 Networks. We've also got an explanation from Facebook as to why their services were out for so many hours on Wednesday into Thursday morning. Stay tuned for more. Big news this week from F5 Networks, where the company has agreed to acquire Nginx for $670 million. Nginx is primarily known for its open source web server that launched in 2004, but now it develops and markets software that complements F5's offerings. The, ac the acquisition is supposed to close in the second quarter. As our reporter Christine Hall explains, Nginx will help F5 develop more offerings around containers, which the company sees as a growing opportunity. If you're a fan of Nginx's open source product, there's no reason to fear, according to the companies. They have no plans to get rid of that. Facebook, as well as Facebook-owned services including Instagram and WhatsApp, were down from Wednesday to Thursday morning in the longest outage the services have seen since Down Detector started tracking them in 2012. The cause of the outage? A server configuration change, according to Facebook. For more on that, check out our website. Are you on the hunt for a new application performance monitoring tool? If so, look no further than our brand new buyer's guide, which just launched this week. I'll add a link so you can download the guide, but it's a great way to look at the top tools as well as the different features and functionalities that you need as an enterprise. That is it for me today. Thank you so much for joining me. I'll see you here next Friday with more headlines. In the meantime, please check out our website. It's itprotoday.com and be sure to subscribe to our newsletters so you can get your daily dose of these tech headlines in your inbox. Thanks again, and I'll see you next time.